this segment of the rap rejuvenation of this beautiful flat in Amsterdam using cover style interior film and tips and tricks from the Rap Institute, you're going to see how to wrap the frame of this mirror so that it perfectly matches the wood interior film that the wall was wrapped in to get a seamless design flow. Let's wrap and roll. The first step is to add masking tape to the mirror portion just at the base of the frame. This will help lower the surface energy. The next step is to clean it with Sot Surface Cleaner 2. Even though the mirror is new, this will help degrease the surface. Then it's time to apply cover style primer to the top edge. This is to help ensure hold, as the film will be wrapped around this top corner. Adding a bit of heat can accelerate the drying process. The next step is to prep the panel. Using masking tape to hold it on one side, unfurl the panel, then mark where the overlap will be with a dry erase marker. Then using the same marker, estimate where the material needs to be cut off so there's just enough of the material to wrap around, but not too much so that it makes it difficult. On a cutting mat from cover style, trim the excess film away, then place 3M knifeless tape, in this case precision line, on the top edge. This will help cut the film without having to use a knife. Now release the liner, roughly 10 centimeters, and lock it in place. It's very important that this edge of the panel is 100% straight, as if it fits properly right on the edge, it means that no knife will have to cut away the excess film. So once this is set, simply release the liner in increments and squeeze it onto the surface, making sure this material stays nice and uniform. So squeezing in roughly 20 centimeter segments at a time is definitely the key and always use the hard side of the squeegee to tuck it in the gap. So the buffer side for the main surface, hard squeegee for the edge. And once the material hits the overlap, now place masking tape and make sure the overlap is roughly two to three millimeters. It doesn't need to be any bigger than this. Cut the excess material safely away. Then once it's removed, it's time to form the film around the top edge. Add heat to soften the film and put on an application glove. This will help the fingers slide on the top edge. Once the film is the top edge, heat it again and work in increments and form the film roughly one centimeter towards the other side. Once everything is sealed in place, now it's time to release the 3M knifeless tape. Be sure to pull perpendicular. And once the excess film has been removed, always come back in with the hard side of the squeegee to make sure the edge of the film is 100% on the surface and now we're ready for the outside piece. Flip the mirror carefully over and set it on the cutting mat face down. Spray Sot Surface Cleaner 2 on the paper towel. Clean the back edge. Then add an even layer of cover style primer to the edge. Allow it to dry roughly 10 minutes before install. So during the drying time, the knifeless tape can be placed on the edge of the piece that was just cut off. So this means there'll be an overlap of roughly two to three millimeters. This will help ensure long-term hold. Make sure the knifeless tape is applied 100% uniform from side to side. Now it's time to place the top piece. Make sure the wood grain is even, lock it on one side, place the mirror vertically to make the squeegeeing process easier, remove the liner, squeegee, then remove the liner, squeegee, so a nice, even, steady workflow, then release the knifeless tape. Pull away the excess film and make sure the edge is 100% sealed. Adding heat will help with this process. Once the outside edge is sealed, now it's time to focus on the back. Here. Use the natural shrink of the film to simply add heat and it will conform to the back edge without having to squeegee or pull. This is called zero stretch. Tuck the film into the outside edge with the hard side of the squeegee, then cut the film safely away with the tip of the stainless steel blade right in the groove and rotating the mirror so the cutting position is comfortable is critical to avoid any mistakes. Once the excess film has been cut away, remove it safely by pulling towards the inside, then double check that the edges are fully sealed. The final step is to spray the mirror with Sot Surface Cleaner 2 and remove any handprints from the install process. And once the mirror is clean, simply place it on the wall. And as you can see, a dramatic transformation. Same beautiful shape, but now the frame is nice and light and matches the wall. To upgrade an object like this in your office or home with interior wrap film, keep in mind that you can go to CoverStyle.com or a CoverStyle distributor in your region to purchase the wrap film and hire a professional installer. Or you can even do it yourself 
using the tips and tricks from this video or a more detailed video for professionals that is on the Rep Institute. You can also take a workshop at CoverStyle headquarters in Luxembourg to get hands-on training as well. And be sure to check out the other videos in this rap rejuvenation series on this flat in Amsterdam to get inspired and for great install tips and tricks.